where this is JBJ. Whoa. So that's what the scrolls cape is all about. Hello there. Oh, where am I? This is JBJ Blaze! And welcome back to a whole new Blazy Log, this sucker. And I am so excited for it. Number 41 on December the 12th, 2014. I was about to say 2012 for some odd reason. And you know what's even greater about today? Is that yesterday, Scrolls finally came out. Thus why I have this new awesome t cape tape and I would like to thank you Mojang from the bottom of my heart for your hard work on these games including scrolls and I also apologize for the long uh, it's I think it's actually been about a month now since the last blazy log and I apologize for that for I've been busy these past weeks quite a bit. We've had trade shows, which one of them I got to see Mr. Grenville Pinto at. He's a very good violinist. And I forgot to get me some more stairs. But he kind of rolls in a way like Lindsey Sterling in the way that he does a lot of covers of the popular songs. And he even did bleed it out. Which reminds me that- Oh shoot, I don't want a button. But- Oh, that's what I want, stairs. But among the other songs he's done- Actually, no, 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 that's not what it was. Among other videos, I do plan on bringing this upcoming Christmas season, which turns out it's actually pretty good timing to finally- release them because we've had Chris not Hardwick Hadfield on a Skype call with my school John McGregor and so I'm gonna be releasing a video of that and a Blanc News perspective which both are really way overdue and so I'm quite excited to try and get those out as soon as possible I'm not too sure if I will be able to get to it tonight but I'm really, really hoping to do, to start a whole new podcast and all four scrolls. And I'm hoping for a response from Mr. Brent T. Copeland on if I may use the name Reem for it. Because if you remember this episode of The Shaft way back when, they did an April Fool's called The Reem, which was for scrolls. Now, here's a good question. What the heck should I do next to this poor house? I haven't worked on it in a month. Uh, I've made attempts only to find out that I I've kind of forgotten how to do Blazy Log. But mostly because I got to talk about uh, what's been going on with me. And I felt like I got to say the right thing and everything. And it's just bugged me a bit. And... I feel like I'm finally getting back into the swing of things, which is also part of why I'm so hyped for this Christmas season, because I'm going to be bringing out what should have gone out much earlier. Do I have any sugar? No, not sugar canes. Actually, no, I have loads of those, the other crops, wheat crops. But speaking of podcasts... The Shaft Podcast and Beating a Dead Horse, those ones have actually been on shorter hiatuses, three weeks for both of them, each. And then, what else has there been? I've, I think I'm, yeah, I missed out on the last eight bits, which was a bit disappointing, but oh well. Oh yeah, that's what I was going to do to this thing. I was going to put some slabs on there for the roof part that is and the other thing what was the other thing oh yeah the other podcast is a Vic Spacement which they just did their rocket and ray gun awards tonight which I was a bit disappointed to see spoiler alert Wolfenstein the not the next order not go as far it, it went pretty far but 
could have gone further and myself I haven't even played the game yet because it's 50 gigabytes and I don't even have about 10 gigs left on my computer's main hard drive which yes I could easily put it onto my terabyte hard drive but that's all for my videos whether it's movies or TV shows as well as the rest of my torrents which reminds me that's something I'm wanting to get for this Christmas is a two terabyte hard drive. What's my time? I'm pretty good. Really into the swing of things again for sure. So let's make up some more slabs. I mean not, sl yeah slabs. Of course slabs. Just need planks first though. And then tomorrow I'll be getting to shoot a couple hockey games with TV Kojiko. Which is Again, where I co-op at, if I haven't said so already. And recently, I think it was December the 3rd, if that was the Thursday. Yeah, December the 3rd, I'm pretty sure it was. I was finally able to get my mother, myself, and my friend, who goes by the same name as myself, Nathaniel, to go see... The Mockingjay Part 1, and my gosh, was that an excellent film. They, they stay so true to the books, but I guess according to my mother, they did uh, bliss over some things, but of course they gotta keep it PG rated, or at least 14A rated, because of course in Canada we have 14A. And... Uh, in my law class, we're getting to watch some of Cool Hand Luke, which is supposed to be this, uh, it's from the 70s, about a guy who, um, in the beginning, he's taking parking meters off their poles while intoxicated, and he gets charged with two years, and basically, things go on from there, and apparently it's... And actually, it's actually a true story. And he was a veteran. And then the other movie we've gotten to watch, which was also very good. Although I've never seen Morgan Freeman in such a role. But he still did just amazingly. That is Shawshank Redemption. And in our law class, that that's one of the perks about it. Is you get to see just terrific films. Uh, although, of course, I guess Catch Me If You Can didn't do as good as it probably should have in the with critics, but I still find it to be a very good film. And after all, you can't get any better than the whole go woof yourself joke <laughs> by Tom Hanks. And, uh... I'm laughing, at it. I'm laughing at it a bit more that I gotta refer to it as woof and go woof yourself. <laughs> and then, uh, so Blaze on Nation episode 19, I'm also still working on. Hopefully we'll get that out tonight and tomorrow, if not uh, tomorrow and Sunday. Because, of course, I don't release stuff on Sundays. And after all, that's apparently, that that's supposed to be the Sabbath day, which, and yes, I know I'm a Christian, I'm Catholic, and I should be paying attention to this stuff, and I am guilty of not really paying attention to the Sabbath day. But I finally decided that, and, and I mean, in the first place, I don't really do much for really work on Sundays anyways, so I think I'm quite safe there. We've had the career fair for my co-op, which went better than my board, or at least for the or oral communication part. And yeah, I think that just about covers everything. I'm very, very surprised and pleased. But I think I am going to have to go and hopefully get a few other things done tonight before I am out of time. But thank you all for tuning in to see me again after four weeks. Check out my scrolls cape again. And bye. Bye! Oh wait, I still have unos, dos, tres, cuatro. 
Am I gonna run out of time yet? Bye bye! This is JBJ Blaze tuning out!